Spectral Domain Optical Coherence Tomography, or SDOCT, has been cited as the most significant advancement in eye care during the last decade. Even in the absence of clinical signs and or symptoms, SDOCT allows practitioners to detect retinal pathologies that cannot be seen with traditional forms of ophthalmoscopy. Additionally, SDOCT provides a more detailed insight into the etiology of clinical symptoms and signs that cannot be accurately diagnosed based upon clinical observation alone. With a better understanding of the problem, SDOCT may present an opportunity for intervention before an emerging pathology becomes clinically significant. By incorporating OptiView's Eye Wellness Exam SDOCT Patient Pay Program into your practice, you've chosen to proactively detect the earliest signs of disease or confirm the health of your patient's eyes. Patients have chosen your practice and look to you as their healthcare professional to provide the most comprehensive examination for them. All patients want the best care that you can give them. When patients check in, they should be handed an eye wellness exam laminated fact sheet and told to read about this important procedure that is highly recommended by their doctor. Eye wellness exam brochures should also be available for patients to read. Front desk staff will politely tell the patient that the technician or doctor will be able to answer any additional questions. Hi, welcome to Bay City Optometry. How are you? Great, thanks. Great. Well, I'm excited to inform you that we've recently added a new breakthrough technology to our comprehensive eye exam. Dr. Burke has ordered this test for you today, so if you wouldn't mind to read over this fact sheet while you wait to be called into pretest. And should you have any further questions, feel free to ask your technician or your doctor. Okay. Thank you. During pretest, the technician will seat the patient at the instrument where another copy of the laminated fact sheet is displayed. The technician will ask the patient if he or she had a chance to read the fact sheet. If the patient says no, the technician will ask them to read it in the pretest area. The technician will briefly explain the procedure and why the doctor recommends it and state that it is a non-covered service. Unless the patient expresses reservations, the technician performs the eye wellness exam and saves the images. The next test is the eye wellness exam, which Dr. Burke has ordered for you today. Did you have a chance to read the fact sheet in the reception area? Yes. This unique technology can help detect signs of disease that are invisible to traditional methods of examination. The imaging takes just a few moments, and Dr. Burke will review the results of this exam with you in the room. There is a $39 copay for the eye wellness exam, and this will be added to your charges for today's exam. Unless you have any questions, I'm going to ask that you place your chin in the chin rest. In most cases, there will be no questions, and the patient will follow the lead of the technician. However, in some cases, the patient will voice concerns or object to the test. In those instances, understanding how to respond to the most common objections will be the key to success. If it's not covered by my insurance, I don't want it. I understand your concern about having to pay out of pocket for this exam. And believe me, we don't take that for granted. Dr. Burke would not order any testing he did not feel was necessary. This new imaging technology has become standard of care in our practice because it can see areas of the eye invisible to standard examination techniques, allowing the doctor to potentially detect vision-threatening conditions at a much earlier point. You'll get a chance to see and discuss the results of your eye wellness exam when you go into the room with the doctor. Unfortunately, vision plans don't typically cover this kind of advanced technology. But the good news is that the copay is only $39. Should we go ahead and complete the test now, or would you rather speak to the doctor before we complete the test? If the patient insists that they need to hear from the doctor, the technician will defer the patient to the doctor and indicate in the patient's chart that he or she has questions about the eye wellness exam. Well, if the test is so important, I want to talk to my doctor. Sure. The doctor will be happy to discuss it with you. In the exam lane, before the start of the eye examination, the doctor should check to see if the patient received the eye wellness exam. If the chart reveals that the patient has questions, the doctor should ask the patient what questions they have about the eye wellness exam. The doctor will further educate the patient as to the benefits of the eye wellness exam and ask the patient to reconsider as the procedure is highly recommended for every patient every year. I appreciate you working with my technician to get your other pretesting done. 
However, I understand that you have a question about the eye wellness exam. What can I answer for you? Well, I understand my insurance doesn't cover this test, doctor. Is it really that important that I have this test done? I ordered the eye wellness exam because I believe it is important. It's my preferred way of analyzing the health of your eyes. These images provide information that is invisible to me using other technologies. As technology evolves, we are able to provide better care, and our goal is to provide the best care possible. With the eye wellness exam, we are trying to catch the earliest indications of eye or systemic health issues when they are easiest to treat. I do strongly encourage you to have the eye wellness exam today. Remember that most of the time, less is more when explaining to your patients why you want the procedure done. Often they just want to hear it from the doctor. If the patient decides to proceed with an eye wellness exam and the doctor's schedule permits, the doctor should walk the patient to the pre-test area where the technician will perform the eye wellness exam and save the images. Afterwards, the doctor will return to the exam lane with the patient where he or she will commence with the eye exam which will include an interactive review of the eye wellness exam reports with the patient. If the patient still declines the procedure, the doctor should encourage them to plan on it for following years. Sight-threatening eye diseases like macular degeneration, glaucoma, diabetic retinopathy are all expected to increase significantly in the coming years, and often the only way to see the early onset of these conditions is through this type of imaging technology. With this in mind, I strongly urge you to have an eye wellness exam during your eye exam next year. We want to provide you with the best eye care possible, and the eye wellness exam helps us achieve that. The majority of patients will have accepted the eye wellness exam in pretest. This will be indicated in the patient's medical record. For those patients, the doctor should reinforce the decision by reminding the patient of the benefits of the technology and recommend that it be an annual procedure. I appreciate you working with my technician to get all of your pretesting done for your comprehensive eye exam. We brought the eye wellness exam, SDOCT, advanced technology, into our office because of the value it brings to the health evaluation of your eyes. The eye wellness exam allows us to see beneath the surface and detect the earliest indications of disease that may not have other signs or symptoms and that are not visible to us using other technologies or tests. When we compare the eye wellness exam images taken today to the ones in future years, we can look for any signs of change. Using this protocol, the target patient acceptance rate is 80% or higher. Remember that the patient chooses your practice for his or her eye care and the eye wellness exam will help you deliver a higher level of clinical care as well as an enhanced patient experience. How can we enhance the patient experience with a diagnostic test? From the patient's perspective, the missing component to a great eye exam experience is the complete doctor-patient relationship. The eye wellness exam by OptiView enhances the doctor-patient relationship with the SDOCT images and provides a means of communicating why eye examinations are important. These are your eye wellness exam high definition OCT images. Like an MRI for the eye, this test shows me things that are invisible to me any other way. SDOCT can show us signs of disease much earlier, both ocular and systemic diseases such as glaucoma, diabetic retinopathy, macular degeneration, and others. When caught in the earliest stages, these diseases are more likely to respond to treatment and we can slow progression. This technology fundamentally changes the way we can now do eye exams. Let me show you what these images reveal and explain what I'm looking for. Use these techniques for reviewing the eye wellness exam in the exam lane as part of the educational and clinical experience. Open right eye report. Review B-scan cross-sectional image. Explain out loud to patients at each step what the image is and what you are looking for. Review the retinal thickness map. Review the ganglion cell complex thickness map. Open left eye report and repeat. Open OU report. This image is a cross-section of the macular area of your right eye, and this indentation is the fovea. This is the area where light is focused, where most of your central vision is found, and where you see fine detail. These are the different layers of your retina, and it is in these substructures that I'm looking for any signs of early eye disease. Fortunately, I see no signs of fluid or other deposits in these layers. This is your nerve fiber layer. You were born with about a million nerve fibers that connect your photoreceptors to the visual cortex in the back of your brain. We want to watch for any thinning of the nerve fiber layer as that could indicate early stages of glaucoma. 
Glaucoma is known as the sneak thief of sight because it's usually asymptomatic, and as it progresses, it slowly robs people of their sight. You mentioned that you have a family history of glaucoma, so we will be checking from year to year for any changes in your images. But yours looks normal today. This is your choroid and contains the vasculature system which provides the retina with nutrients and oxygen. Yours looks healthy, but here again we want to make sure there is no change in this layer over time as that could be a sign that the retina is starving. This is the retinal thickness map. This map covers the 7 by 7 millimeter area surrounding your macula. The map would show if there was an area in your retina that was unusual and required further testing. Fortunately, your map shows nothing abnormal. This is your ganglion cell complex thickness map. Your ganglion cell complex could reveal some of the earliest signs of damage from glaucoma. We want this area to look like a green donut around the fovea, and that is exactly what yours looks like today. Now let's take a look at your left eye. Again, the cross section of your macula looks good, as does the surrounding tissue shown on your retinal thickness map. And your ganglion cell complex thickness map shows no signs of structural change. Finally, we want to look at both eyes together to make sure there are no signs of asymmetry, as asymmetry can often indicate abnormalities or signs of disease. Again, everything in your report looks great. If the patient's images reveal any fluid, exudates, drusen, or other abnormalities, the doctor may choose to use the image database to further educate the patient about the condition. The doctor should complete the eye wellness exam discussion by stating that the images are a permanent part of the patient's medical record, which will provide a baseline to compare against in the future. These eye wellness exam reports are now part of your permanent medical record. When you come back next year, we can compare these images to the ones we take at next year's eye exam, so we can look for changes. The more prepared you and your staff are to educate patients about the value of the eye wellness exam, the better your practice will be at overcoming objections. Let's review how to handle some typical objections. You may hear... This test seems expensive. Well, most people value their eyesight more than any other sense. The eye wellness exam is much like a body scan, CT scan, or MRI, all of which have raised the level of preventative care and all of which cost hundreds, even thousands of dollars. In comparison to the valuable information the eye wellness exam provides our doctors, the nominal fee of $39 can actually be seen as a bargain. Certainly the patients and families of patients that have discovered eye and systemic diseases with the assistance of the eye wellness exam believe it is money well spent. You only have one set of eyes. You want to do all that you can to protect your gift of sight. Or a patient might ask, Do I really need it? The doctor's always given me a good exam in the past without this test. As technology advances and breakthroughs become available, such as the eye wellness exam SDOCT, it enables doctors to provide a better level of clinical eye care. This technology allows Dr. Burke to see beneath the surface of the back of your eye. It provides cross-sectional images of the layers of your retina, which is not visible with traditional exam methods. This can help identify disease earlier when there may be no outward signs or symptoms and when the disease is most treatable. Or you might hear, I had a picture taken at the last exam. Cameras use different technology and only provide a static image of the surface of the back of the eye. The eye wellness exam technology provides information about your eye health that is not available with any other technology or exam method because it scans beneath the surface of your eye and details the retina layers. This can help identify disease earlier when there may be no outward signs or symptoms and when the disease is most treatable.